It is essentially a stretched out macrodose, you know, it's, aside from experiencing it over the course of X amount of hours, you know, it's just X amount of days. But in, in my experience with it, I feel like after a while you kind of just don't, you feel like you don't really need to take it as much right on. Right. Uh, if, it's, if it's really doing what it's doing. I would just take advantage of the breaks, like a 15 minute break or the lunch break. Let's go do a quick 15 minute lucid view. <laughs> yeah. Just like soar over the city real quick. Alright, I'm fresh. I can get back. <laughs> and unload these, uh, these tilts. That was kind of a thing too that I was doing, just like uh, printing out something in black and white and then painting around it. Yeah, me and my mom. I had cut it like that because uh, cause my printer was fucking up. Oh, I didn't see some of these. Oh yeah, some uh, B-sides, <laughs> Rare Pleasure B-sides. I'll be right there. That's the B-side. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's in the record, right? Yeah, that's on the, um, the inner sleeve. The little glitter sticker. When I start, I don't know where it's going to go. Sometimes I think that I don't like where it's going, and then it ends up going somewhere where I'm like, like I kind of like where this blue is going right now. Mm -hmm. The destination will present itself along the way. There's no, like... Ah, I ruined it. Right. Like, ruined what? What did, you, right, right. what did we ruin? What were we trying to do? Like, oh, we were trying to do something? I thought we were just painting. This is pretty much how the Rare Pleasure cover came to be. It was just having... I printed that out and then I painted like a red circle around that. And uh, I think that's all that that was. It was just having... Just doing this enough and then being like, oh, I think I kind of see the cover. Instead of being like, I'm going to do the cover now. But it's a fun journey trying to uncover whatever that is.